Hello once again, Internet. Kankage93 here. Um, I don't know if you can hear the audio of the game, but... Oh, it is recording. Um, we have Pokemon Emerald. I figured I'd give it a go with, um... I don't know how the game can be played. Okay. Obviously, I'm doing this. I'm an emulator. But, anyways. Um. Eh. Hi, sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Birch. But everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. This is what we call a Pokemon. I know what a Pokemon is, idiot. This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon at times as friendly playmates and at times as cooperative workmates. And sometimes we band together and battle others like us. But despite our closeness, we don't know everything about Pokemon. We don't even know how many there are. In fact, there are many, many secrets surrounding Pokemon. To unravel Pokemon mysteries, I've been undertaking research. Why don't you research why everybody likes Mudkips? That's what I do. And you are... Are you a boy or are you a girl? You know, it pisses me off that they can never tell what gender you are. I mean... God. What, did they just get a silhouette? I'll be a boy. Obviously. Alright, what's your name? Now, I guess I understand not knowing the name, but seriously. Oh. And perfect. Show it's Kinkage. Yeah. Ah, okay. You're Kinkage, who's moved to my hometown of Little Root. I get it now. You know, the one thing about Pokemon Emerald is you don't have a real rival. Alright, are you ready? Your very own adventure is about to unfold. Take courage and leap into the world of Pokemon where dreams, adventure, and friendships await. Friendship. God, I can help but do that. Uh, well, it's, I'll be expecting you later. Come see me in my Pokemon lab. And here we go. Oh, what? I honestly never get why I'm in a truck. Wouldn't I already just be in the house? King Kage, we here, honey. I must, it must be tired and run with our things in the moving truck. Where well, is this little new town? How do you like it? This is our new home. It looks like shit. I don't care. It has a quaint feel, but it seems to be an easy place to live, don't you think? No, it looks awful. You get your own room, you dire. Damn straight. Let's go inside. I never get where the mom sleeps in these games. See, can y'all get ill and nice here, do you? No, it's shit. We better be get able to keep Pokemon. The movers Pokemon do all the work and moving us in and leaving up after us. That is freaking lazy, man. This is so convenient. God. I know, I realize I'm ten years old, but I'm sure I could at least carry some of this stuff in. Kinkage, your room is upstairs. Go check it out, dear. Dad bought you a new clock to mark our move here. 
Wow, a clock? Don't forget to set it! Hey, how's it going? Okay. Uh, it's a Vigoroth. Both of them are. GameCube? Where's the Xbox? Clock is stopped. Better set it and start it. Uh wait a second. That says it's ten. It's ten dirty where I'm at. Hey Kaka, how do you like your working room? It's shit. Good. Everything's put away neat. I love how she says Good, even after I said it's shit. He finished moving everything in downstairs too. Pokemon movements are so convenient. Fucking lazy. Oh, you shouldn't make sure that everything's all there on your desk. What the hell? And Kage flipped open the notebook. Adventure rule number one. Open the menu with start. Or in this case, the enter button. Um, adventure two. Uh, adventure rule number two. <laughs> Record your progress with save. Yeah, the remaining pages are blank. Wow, there's only two rules. Hey, Kaka, I booted up the PC. What would you like to do? Nothing. Actually, you know, I would like to play a game on the computer. Ew, Kikage, Kikage, quick, come quickly. God. Look, it's Battleborn's gym. Maybe Dad will be on. Oh, yeah. For those who haven't played, we brought you this report from in front of Battleborn's gym. Oh, it's over. I think Dad was on, but we missed him. Too bad. Oh, yes, one of Dad's friends lives in town. Has a bird in it. Is his name. He lives right next door, so you should go over and introduce yourself. You know, I don't think I mentioned this at all at this point, but um, I'm going to try doing the Nuzlocke challenge, which is basically um, any Pokemon that dies, or like faints, dies. Hey, Professor Bear. Professor Swain, fieldwork are going here. Oh, let me explain what fieldwork is. I know what fieldwork is, dumbass. It is to study things in the natural environment like fields and mountains instead of a laboratory. No shit. Prof is one for doing this work. He's the type of person who would rather go outside and experience things that breed them in here. You should do something too, you idiot. And another thing is that you can only catch, um, one Pokemon per area. Um, 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 if you go outside and go in the grass, wild Pokemon will jump out. It's dangerous if you don't have your own Pokemon. This is where you get your Pokemon, you dumbass. Ah. Fresh bird. Um, why am I... I... Suddenly turning into my mom. In the game. My gay mom. I didn't know, know he had a house. Oh, hello, and you are? Da 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 da. Oh, you can cut a new next door neighbor. Hi! We have a daughter about the same age as you. My daughter was excited about making you a new friend. Our daughter is upstairs, I think. Ew, item. Oh, she gets an orange GameCube. Yes. I don't know what voice to do. Um, huh? Who are you? Oh, you're Kinkage. So you move us today. Um, I'm me. Glad to meet you. I I have this dream of becoming friends. With Pokemon all over the world. 
I I heard about you can come away from my dad, Professor Bird. God, my voice is cracking so much. I was hoping that you would be nice, King Kage, and that we could be friends. Oh, this is silly, isn't it? I've just met you, King Kage. Now I want to fuck you. Nah, you know, you can't have sex in this. You can only breed. <laughs> oh no, I forgot. I was supposed to go help Dad catch some wild Pokemon. King Kage, I'll catch you later. Yeah, you go on Facebook. Way before Facebook. Um, I am probably not going to be able to keep track of voices. Um, hi. Now I'm scared of Pokemon outside. I can hear the crash. I want to go see what's going on. But I don't have any Pokemon. Can you see? You were just saying it. You fucking hypocrite. Can you go see what's happening for me? You fucking hypocrite. Help me! God, I don't think I remember the voice from freaking earlier. Hello, you over there. Please, help. In my bag, there's a Pokeball. There's more than one Pokeball. Okay. Professor Birch is in trouble. Release a Pokemon to rescue him. Ah, uh, let's see. Uh, Torchic, Mudkip, or Tree Cow. Well, I just have one question for you, Internet. You like monkeys? Do you choose this Pokemon? Yeah. Boom, 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 boom. Wild Zigzagoon appeared. Okay. So basically, um, because of the Nuzlocke challenge, I guess I'm only able to catch her a um Zigzagoon since it's the first Pokemon that you see in an area. Now, obviously, in other videos of me doing this, I'm going to be uh, not remembering uh, what Pokemon I caught in which area, so it'll, like, reset or something. So if I come back to this area, there might be a Poochiana or a uh, Silcoon or something. Not a Silcoon, a Whirlpool. That okay. True. I was in tall grass studying wild Pokemon when I was doomed. You saved me. Thanks a lot. Oh, hi, you're King Kage. Yes, and I'm a boy too. This is not the place to chat, so come by my Pokemon lab later, okay? So, King Kage. How the fuck did we get here? I've heard so much about you from your father. You know my father? I've heard that you don't have your own Pokemon yet. I'm stealing this Mudkip. You can't do anything about it. But the way you battled earlier, you pulled it off with... A plum? What the fuck is a plum? I guess you can... You have your father's blood in your veins, after all. Um... That's... Creepy. Oh yes, thanks for rescuing me. I'd like you to have the Pokemon you used earlier. Uh, of course. Kinkage received the Mudkip! While you're at it, why not give a nickname to that mudkip? No, nicknames are dumb. If you work at Pokemon and gain experience, I think you'll make an extremely good trainer. My kid May is also studying Pokemon while helping me out. Kenkage, don't you think it might be a good idea to go see May? I've never seen what happens when you say no. I'm curious. Oh, don't be that way. You should go meet my kid. Oh, God, it's...
doing the freaking Yu-Gi-Oh! Sacred Cards loop. Fine. Great. May should be happy to get made to teach you what it means to be a train. I know what it means. Probably nothing. Hello. Okay. Sorry. My mic wasn't working for a sec. Okay. I don't know why I'm holding the mouse. I don't need it for anything. Do I have anything? Got no items. So he sends me with no items. And you know, actually, this is probably a good time to um, end it right here. So, like, favorite, subscribe. Don't dislike or spam because nobody likes that. And um, I'm thinking this might be a Saturday video. I don't know. I might change it for a different day, but for now, it'll be on Saturdays. So, later.